The tragic accident in the Fenway neighborhood, a woman riding a bicycle was hit and killed by a cement truck. Now, the truck driver stopped, and tonight we know that he was taken to the hospital for evaluation. Christina Rex now has more on the investigation and the identity of the 69-year-old victim. State police say it happened when the light turned green and a cement truck pulled forward, hitting and killing Paula Sharaga of Cambridge in an intersection that cyclists say is busy any time of day. Craig Cavanaugh rides his bike through this busy Fenway intersection daily and says while he's heartbroken, he's not surprised to learn of the death of a Cambridge woman Friday afternoon. I mean, I personally have been hit by cars three times in Boston, and I've been doored twice when someone swings out the door and, and gets you that way. Yeah, so... I know what it's like. Police say Paula Sharaga was riding her bike through the intersection when she was struck by a cement truck. She was brought to Brigham and Women's Hospital, where she died from her injuries. As police measured distances by foot and weighed this cement truck, her bike lay mangled in the center of the busy intersection, where Brookline Ave meets Park Drive. It's definitely not a safe street to be on. I mean Walkers and cyclists agree it's a risky intersection to travel, and local groups like Longwood Cyclists have been pushing for more bike lanes. Here in this intersection, is notoriously bad. We've talked about it for years, and unfortunately, it uh, it you know takes a death for everyone to get involved and figure it out. In the meantime, cyclists urge all travelers to be more careful. You know, people need to care more about people around them and and not be in such a rush. State police say the driver of the cement truck was a 67-year-old man from Salem. They don't know yet if they're going to press charges. In Fenway, Christina Rex, WBZ News.